and we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create text with strokes in multiple colors. We need some text first. The font plays a huge role so pick something that looks good. I'll just pick the sans serif but I definitely want to make it italic and I keep the bold. Style. So that looks fine for this example. Make sure it's selected. Then go to filters, morphology, now we've got the outline effect right here. Then we check the live preview. It's directly applied. And you can play around with the width and the dilatation one. I would almost say ignore the other options. Obviously you can adjust them as well and see what happens. But for the most part, you want to stick to the width one and the dilatation one. We've got this smooth box. All it does is it gives it a little bit of a blur. So you can see that where the black meets the turquoise color here. I don't want to have that, so I uncheck it. Let me go to color and here we've got, for example, the color wheel. And we can use that to create different colors. If you want to add the next outline or the next stroke in this case, just check the live preview again, change the color. Maybe you want to adjust the options a little bit. At some point you can see when you make it too big, you reach the end of the bounding box of the text and there it gets cut off. So keep that in mind when you adjust the size of it. There are also two drop downs that I haven't yet talked about. For now I've got it to a position of outside set. You can also put it to the inside or make it an overlay. In most cases, outside is the one you need. The composite type, just check it and see what happens. In and over should be the two options that you need the most. And when you've got what you want, just close your menu. Don't forget to apply the last stroke though. Select it and you can go to file and export it. It will be exported as a single element. And this is how you can create strokes for text that have multiple colors in Inkscape. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.